What up, guys? And we're back for some FIFA Ultimate Team here. So as we come out, we're going to go ahead and look at his team and see what he's got here. Lulu Akaku at the top. Oh, he's got Alexis Sanchez. He's got Kaz, Kazrol, I think that's his name. So, I mean, I could depict that this guy is probably about money just for the fact that he has Alexis Sanchez. Like, that guy is not even affordable this year. I mean, damn. I had him last year. That guy could shoot, could pass. I think his acceleration is really good. That's cheese. But his uh, speed's really good because he has his speed's like an 87, but his acceleration has to be crazy because that dude would accelerate. And I'd be like, yo, dude, this feels like a 90 or 90, 91. So, you know, I'm trying to come out. I'm trying to get a win here because I believe I have to. I know I'm definitely close to relegation, but I forgot, like, how many games are left and how many points I have. Maybe I'll see it at the end here. If not, I believe I address it in the next video. So he's coming down. We're just trying to cut it off. I'll show you, see you guys. I have good inside the 18 defense, but right there was not good. I cannot allow that black mammoth to get a shot on goal, which... Normally my inside the 18 defense is good, but right there it was not. So we're coming back, trying to make something happen. And also with the FIFA videos, guys, I know a lot of you don't watch FIFA, don't watch soccer, you're not really interested. I know this is probably very boring for you. So not in this video because this video is 12 minutes, but I've edited like um, six other videos because I still have five other videos to edit. So I have a lot of videos to get edited on, but... I just don't want to stop recording because I feel like I'm going to have a crazy game. And I'm not going to record it like I had a Madden game the other night where I was just going bonkers. I put Reggie Bush in. Reggie Bush. And he went bonkers. Like, I was like, you know what? Fudge it. So I put Reggie in. So you see as I'm, you know, cutting the film, if there's nothing going on for like 20 minutes, I went ahead and cut that out for you guys just so you don't have to just sit there and be bored for the whole time. So that was definitely a foul. Okay, Walcott, I need you to get up, brother. So they're coming back, you know, trying to make a play happen. And another frustrating thing that happened is I had, as you can see, I have Gareth Bale. I had this brother for seven games on a, I got him from a premium loan pack that I received just for no reason. So I had him for seven games. I think this dude scored one time. I mean, it was the most frustrating thing ever because, I mean, I have Gareth Bale, one of the best players in the game. One of the easiest players to control, and every time I use him against anybody I play, really, I normally go off with him. But for some reason, on this team, now you know. Also, I don't know if it was had anything to do with the chemistry, because he had no. Of course, he's, you know, he plays for Real Madrid, and I forgot um, what nationality he is, but he's nothing to do with England. So he had no kinds of uh, colors going to him, which is all red. So I don't know if that had anything to do with it or what, but um, he didn't really do anything for me at all for the seven games that he played with me. So we're trying to counter here. We need a goal. So I'm trying to do some Sadu magic, and I'm off size, unfortunately. I don't know, man. With FIFA, look at Sadu. Did you see how he sold off the block like that, made the pass? He set all this up back to him, but... And that's definitely a foul. Like, how is that not a foul, dude? Like, this can be punking you sometimes. Like, and what really thinks is because I'm cutting the film down, you guys won't be able to see a lot of things, that, a lot of crappy things that's happened to me in this game. I hope I get a few here. I mean, it's just things that you're just like, wow, dude, that's just really bad luck. So somehow he crosses me a little attacker. And all he's really using is his physical ability to get around. He's not using any speed, not using any as I perf play a perfect ball to Sadu Dumbia, and it's freaking blocked. But I get fouled. So, in that case, what I normally like to do is go down the middle, and he went to the left. So, get back in the game with that. We needed that. Thank you, Sadu Dumbia. From now on, I will call him the savior, just so you know, because that's my favorite player, and he is the savior. Look, look, look at him. I should, I didn't think I was going to get through there, so I went ahead and kicked it, but I got through there, and I was like, oh, no, dude, I should have waited one more touch. That would have been another goal for him, because he's a beast. And I'll check this out. 
Another block off the wall. And that's my defender, remember, as my free kicker, so it's kind of embarrassing. That was definitely a foul. It looked like a little contact there, but that's fine. So he's going to make down Lulu Akaku just using his physical ability. I mean, look, he's 6'2". Big dude. I forgot what his physical is, but it's definitely over 80. So this brother be muscling his way through people and making shots. Just trying to avoid any goals here. We know we're getting close to relegation. That was pretty legit by Kevin Morales. I'm just trying not to... I'm trying to keep the games close to where I can either win or at least get a tie because, you know, in a tie, you still get one point. So getting one point is better than getting no points. So that's what we're trying to do right now. That was a beautiful... That was a beautiful chip through there by Kevin Morales. And I'm getting cheesed again with that. But the savior... The savior gets the goal. So that's two for Savior. And I forgot at this point how many goals he has, but right now totally is 108 because I looked at it after the one of my games. He has 108 total goals for my club. Like, that's just crazy. And he will always, always, always have a spot on my team because the dude is just – like, the day he retires or the day his cars go down is a day that I'll be sad. And look at him. He takes on the defenders here. Beautiful take. Did you see the speed burst? Look at him. Beast mode. Oh, chest bump with Musa. Let's go. Seydu Dumbia showing his greatness. And those of you watching this, I'm telling you, get a Seydu Dumbia. The dude is an absolute monster. Now, if you would have got him on FIFA 15, he was a glitch in FIFA 15. Because <laughs> his speed was, like, crazy. Like, he would always be stepping out. Like, he'd be like, man, nobody can really catch that. Plus, he's physical, too. So, it makes it a lot easier for him to make, you know, break through uh, defenders and all that. So, you know, skip it through the game to the 54th minute. Same score. Just trying to make something happen here. He's, he needs to get something going, like, right now. Not now, but right now. So we're just trying to pass it around, be conservative here, get it back to the keeper so he can go ahead and clear it. Those of you who know me on here or played against me on here know that I like to uh, play the ball back to the keeper and just have him clear it because uh, anytime I try to pass within the 18, it seems like I just – it's just a terrible pass, and I always give up a goal that when I hate giving up goals that way. So – that's how I'm going to go ahead and do it from now on. Fucking slide tackle. Oh, get chopped up. And I think, I think I got to get rid of Max Gradle, man. I'm just I'm just tired of him, man. Like, I mean, he's good, man. But for some reason, these last few games, he has not been playing good at all. Like, not at all. The only thing that sucks about getting rid of him is that not only is he, I think he's Colombian. I don't know, but he's the same nationality as Dumbia. So he matches. He matches with Dumbia, and as I'm fouling, oh, I thought I fouled him right there, and I nearly crapped myself, but it was an offside, so I was completely fine with that. But anyways, back to Dumbia and Gradle. Um, Gradle is, matches with Dumbia with nationality and matches with the rest of the, the uh, play, other club players because they're in the same club. He's in the Premier League, and that's where all my players are at. So taking him would really hurt my chemistry. But I was also thinking that I might get a team that's also that's more skilled than speed. So I don't know how that's going to go exactly. I'm debating on what I want to do. And that was a good deflection right there to prevent that goal. So we're in the 77th minute trying to, just trying to play good defense here. So I, I believe I went to a defensive uh, strategy just to prevent that because 3-1 in FIFA can go quicker than hotcakes. So as you can see right there, I'm speaking. And just so y'all know, anybody that gets a score off a corner, that doesn't take any skill. Any skill at all just for the reason that you have tall people, you just kick it in the same section and somebody goes up there and gets it. Like That takes no skill. So anyone that scores off a header and, and brags about it, that's really not impressive, bro. And as you saw there, Sato Dumbia had a hat trick. 
So at this point, it is. It's a terrific effort. It looks like the, the 80th minute. So here. we're just trying to prevent one more goal. And I don't know where my defense is at at all. Bad chip through by him, but that's all right. Yeah, we will they do it, go ahead and throw that to the defenders. See what we can't do here. We're just holding the ball. There goes Nathaniel Klein, the defender. And I don't know what Tyson is over. Here comes Tyson passing for the savior. For them? Tyson. The savior, but a pass to Tyson. I don't know what I do. Why did he run past the ball? Like he saw my meter go up. Really? Man. And point blank shot because it was straight at the keeper. Like, damn, you had the whole goal to kick. I'm pretty sure I aimed towards the far post. That's all right. You know, that's how FIFA does. That's how EA does, actually. They make people. It's not FIFA who makes the game. It's EA Sports. Just trying to be, just trying to be careful here. That's a foul. Got the advantage. Didn't really need it, but that's okay. Yeah, get that man with the bat. So I'm looking at Mongolia here, trying to see what I got, I'm trying to make a play. Hopefully, he's trying to get a header, and I got nothing there. That's okay. And this keeper's trying to kick it out, trying to kick it to a defender. He gets it to a defender. And Gail Clichy with the steal. Dangerous pass there. I was just like, no way, dude. Come on. And Kyle Walker knocks away Lulu Akaku. Like, that was pretty huge. Like, I was like, oh my gosh, if this guy gets another shot on goal and it's close, that is going in. So I'm just trying to play defense for my life here. Bad pass by him, thank God. And of course, as a savage that I am, wasting the clock with the goalkeeper clearing it and going ahead to end the game get the win good win here still trying to avoid the relegation point hopefully i kept the video long enough to see that point i'm not really sure um, it's not looking like it there's some unnecessary highlights going through the Match, man, the match. I can't really see what that is. Not even